Are you ready to go fast, you freaking can? Get ready for some Ron's riding tips. <laughs> I'm always asked is Ron how do you burn blast so well you got the biggest burn blast on the circuit how do you do it one of the biggest things when people talk about the burn blast and they talk about keep your foot off the ground keep your foot up and you know, foot positioning in the corners. Don't let your foot dab down. You know, all think all these people that are telling this, they're all people that are they're slow. They're slower than me, that's for damn sure. Because what I like to do coming in the corner is you like to want to put it off the back side of the bike, almost dragging that leg on the back of your bike. You know, you want to drag it because that's your balance point. You want all your balance and all your weight towards the rear of the bike, the rear tire. So you want your leg back there too. Why would you want your leg on the front tire? Front tire doesn't have any power to it. So I like to drag my leg and put it through the dirt. It helps stabilize me as I'm coming through the turns. And you know, you have a lot of bogus motocross coaches teach you the opposite thing. Keep your leg up and you know, in front of you, don't let it go behind you. But you know, that's just one of those things. You just can't listen to your dumb teacher all the time. Cause they don't know what's best for them. and it's pretty simple when you break it down um i like to always set my berms up and make sure that i'm i've got a big berm i'm gonna hit i'm gonna come into me a big berm dig i just i'm gonna be able to dive down into it and that's what you like when you get in that berm you want to be able to throw her down and then you pop the clutch on the way out and it's you got to be careful when you pop the clutch because sometimes you pop the clutch and it come all the way out from under you but if you get that good clutch pop right in the middle. Yeah. You'll feel it engage the power. Burr! And you come right out and it, I mean, it's magical. It's what it is. It's, it's, um, Poetry in motion, I think they call it. And um, that's what I always try to do with the berm blasting, but it doesn't always work out as planned. Uh, berm blasting, even though it is a very fun thing to do, it is a very dangerous thing. So don't let any you know, rookie berm blasters think they're gonna go be a bunch of hot shots and start blasting berms after this. Take your time. Last but not least, the most important thing to take away from this video is always cut your fenders, folks. <laughs>